Once again, it's T here, the guru of coaching, sharing ideas, tips, and tools to help you be successful in your coaching business. And what I'm really doing is helping you avoid the mistakes that most coaches make. You know, since I've trained, it's close to 6,000 coaches worldwide now in 17 countries. I really understand this industry. I spent a lot of time and energy researching it, and I really want to change this industry. I am just sick and tired of unsuccessful people. I'm just, I really am. It's just ridiculous. It's, there's no other profession that has so many people sitting around not doing well simply because they haven't been taught how to do well. It's been just a lot of, of coaching information that's wrong in one place after the next just repeating that same old information. I'm giving you what's right. I really am. So what I want to share with you today is to make sure that you are spending your time and energy not creating brochures, designing websites, flyers, that you're really not putting expense into your business. I mean, I think it's ridiculous. Lots of coaches are like, well, I'll do that after I have a website. I'll do this, but I'm creating a flyer or brochure. Please let me tell you, your flyer, your brochure, your website's not what's going to sell you. You're going to sell you. Let me just address that for a minute. A lot of people go, oh, selling. I don't want to sell. Please don't say sell. Well, the deal is we do have to sell ourselves. We sell every single day. You know, you sell your family and you say, oh, let's go to eat this kind of food. Okay, that's selling. I'm not talking about manipulating and forcing people to do things. Listen, if you haven't read my book, Sell Without Selling by now, you really need to. You really should because it's a very simple little fable and it'll shift you like this. And it's value for your clients, but that's what I'm here for today. I'm here to say to you, you need to get out there, you need to sell. And sell is not persuade. Sell is simply to showcase your stuff, show people your, you've got expertise. So here's what I want to say to you, and this is controversial in the coaching industry. Uh, I can just tell you all the top coaches making seven figures that I know, all of us, every single one of us does this. And some people may not be honest and may not tell you that they do this. I know they do this. I talk to them. Here's the deal. We give advice. I know these coach training programs that don't give advice. We're not advisors. We're not consultants. My goodness gracious, in today's day and age, if you don't sit up and become someone who gives advice, who gives value, who is a consultant and a mentor, as well as a coach to people, you may as well get out of the industry. Go get a J-O-B and go back to being a slave to somebody telling you what time to come in, when you can eat your lunch, what days you'll be there, and how much they're going to give you for all of that. I don't want people doing that. So here's the deal. Give advice. If you hired me because I am an expert in building entrepreneurial businesses, and if I sat here and said to you, well, I can't give you the answers because you know the answers, what would the answer be if you did know it? Hopefully you would fire me. You should fire me. It's ridiculous. So again, I want you to wake up. Just don't believe the stuff you've been hearing. Hey, if all that great stuff worked, there'd be lots of successful people versus handfuls of people that I've worked closely with. And that's the truth. Take a moment, breathe this in, apply it to your business, and once again, I'm just sitting here giving you these tools and tips out of the goodness of my heart for free because I just will not tolerate this industry being filled with unsuccessful people. Take the tip to heart, use it, because my goal is your success. I have a few more videos for you, so stay tuned. I'll see you soon.